We thought we had technology before, but now we've got real fancy technology. Shout out to Liz for sending this surprise package in the mail. I am delighted. Also, can you tell it is matching Christmas season? Welcome. Welcome to Savage Sips. The December Adventy edition, which is Brooke's very own special sub-series called Sips and Sweets, <laughs> where we show you a sweet that Brooke makes and a drink, a sip, that goes with it. And we're going to work really hard to make sure there are non-alcoholic options on all of the drinks. Where's we going to start with ice? Oh, look, we have fancies. Thanks, Liz. I think that's five. Is the drink. I think you're right. Five is always the best number. In my super fancy new technology. Two, three, oh, four, five, ice. Ice. <laughs> We're gonna start with three shots of eggnog. Ours is going with strong because there's people in our house that love it. That's me. It's great instead of creamer for coffee. Don't forget oatmeal. Just saying. And an oatmeal. I'll do we have more if we need more. So three shots. A generous shot of rum chata. A generous shot of rum chata. What's a generous shot? Aren't those all my shots? They are. <laughs> Fill them to the top. I don't know what other way to do a shot. And then our good old friend, Mr. Gentleman. Kentucky gentleman. <laughs> gentleman down, down yonder. Okay. Yes. Perfect. Oh, in the shot. Mm -mm. Some shot. cinnamon. You're going to do just a couple sugar, sugar, sugars in there. Oh, that was a sugar, sugar, sugar in there. We have a generous cinnamon house. <laughs> Glassware, <laughs> and we're gonna give this cup of rim a cinnamon sugar rim for those of you who have, remember our delightful third sacraments, which is basically the same thing. This fine china ain't taking the cinnamon good. You <laughs> get water on it, and it beads because we're using plastic, and then you. <laughs> oh, yours is better than mine. Fine, get some. We're this is. It's it's a little chunkier. Listen, tis the season. Works. Tis the season. Open, shake it. Mm -hmm. See, <laughs> and you pour, holding back the ice into the glass. Ooh, it pours so pretty. Let's push. If you don't want to slightly dilute your stuff, you can always stir it. Oh. Technology. Technology. And so, this is... I was thinking of Liz and all of this fancy new stuff, and I was thinking of Lily and the cookies. I can stand behind that. Double L eggnog. What if we did H-E-double L nog? <laughs> <laughs> the jury's out on the name right now. Hello. We'll come up with one by the time we do all the things. So, but this is intended to go with these. My chocolate chip cookies. Made from this awesome, super awesome recipe book brought to us by a birthday gift from one Lily. You know who you are. Cookies. And drinkies. 
Mm. It's really good cookie. Yeah. So good. You're not gonna cheers me? Mm. Cheers. Cheers. It's delicious. Oh, it's fantastic. Oh, I love this. Okay. And now, the non-alcoholic version for you all. Okay, we are back for the non-alcoholic version. We're making something of a milkshake, and we're going to see how hard I can shake. We're going to start with two scoops of your favorite cinnamon ice cream. Of note, we happen to be using a certain brand of ice cream that um, They're good people. is Chure or Churros. Um, they're not sponsoring us. If you want to send us ice cream to use in a beverage, please do. Okay, that was a little hard to get out, but that was perfect. Two scoops. Three shots eggnog. Three shots of eggnog. Are you trying? One. Two. It's not going the wrong way. Three shots of eggnog. Mm. And three shots of milk. Three shots of milk. And of course, dash of cinnamon. That was like maybe two dashes of a regular thing of cinnamon, but we need both cinnamon in this house. Shake it. And then we're going to see how you gotta shake how well I it. shake. Oh Put no. On that bad boy. Ah. Well, folks, today was a bit more involved, and so our episode got cut off at the end, but here is me pouring it. Highly recommend, if you can, to stir the ice cream up to help it melt and mix. Then finish adding the stuff and shake a lot and maybe use a spoon, and then it works really well. We did the cinnamon sugar rim just like the other one, and this was delightful. Also, if you are interested in the recipes written down become a Patreon supporter from the link in bio. There you'll find the recipes written down and some suggestions for non-alcoholic options, including for some recipes that we didn't have non-alcoholic options for in the video. Also, if you made it this far, tell me when you noticed our sneaky dinos. For now, here's the H-E-L-L nog and the S-W-E-L-L nog. Enjoy!